All right, so now we are going to take on the new Protect History Time Patrol event, which is very similar to the Legendary Goku event or Infinite Dragon Ball History. You're essentially taking on eight enemies back to back to back. And I don't really know what to expect, but I don't think it's going to be that hard. Um, the enemies are going to be... What does it say here? Basically, it's going to be like Supreme Kai of Time, Super Saiyan 3 uh, Goku, Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, Xeno, Trunks, uh, Bajanks, I think, Teen, Gotenks, and the other fusion. I forgot the name, though, to be honest. But yeah, those are basically the guys. And the types are Stage 1, Super Fizz, and then Super Tech, Super SDR, Super Fizz, Super AGL, Super SDR, Super Int, and Super Tech. Um, is there a limitation on which kinds of characters we can bring or anything like that? I don't think so. We can only bring two support items. All bosses have damage reduction, and they'll use various techniques during battle. And... Uh, it looks like that's it. I don't think there's any restrictions or any requirements for this event. So you can bring any team you want, really. So, should we bring like a stacking team, or is it not necessary? For those of you that already have already done it, um, do you think I need to bring stackers, or can I just bring like anybody and it should be fine? Because I was thinking of just like bringing a lot of damage dealers, like a maybe Majin, uh, Babu Saga, or something like that. I just used Kamehameha and it destroyed it. Yo, Kamehameha destroys like 99% of the events in the game. Actually, probably 100%. If you have a good Kamehameha team, they destroy every event. So that's not even fair. But uh, yeah, let's do that, actually. <laughs> let's do Kamehameha. Why not? We're going to be... We're going to use the cheat code. Um, and just, yeah, bring basically one of, if not the best team in the game right now. And, uh, yeah, it should be a breeze. It should be a breeze. Okay, where's Kamehameha? How hard is it for the for the devs to just list all the categories by alphabetical order? I've been asking for this for, for some time now. Okay, so we're going to go with the blue fusions, because I don't get to use them that much these days, actually. And... Hmm... Who else? UI Goku? Or Rosé? Or they would be fun. But defensively, he's not the best. He's not terrible either. Um, hmm. I don't know. Like, we have too many good options. <laughs> That's a big issue. We have too many, like, very strong options. Uh, why don't we go with double Vegito? And then Vegito Blue. Yeah, something like that. That's okay. Oh, UI? I could, I could go with UI. Mm, maybe I go UI Goku instead of Vegito Blue. But I want Vegito Blue, though. Hmm. Tough call. Tough call. Go Bros. UI. People want to see UI. Okay, so... Yeah, fine. I'll go, I'll go UI. I don't think it really matters that much, to be honest. So, let's jump in. It should be really easy. But if it's not, then... I'm going to have a word with Chris Levy here. Or, I said his name wrong. Chris Levy. Because he's been saying the whole time that this event is really easy. Okay, so maybe he was just saying that to set me up and embarrass me. And that would be very uncool of him. Um, do you watch Attack on Titan? I do. I do. I'm excited for Season 4. When's that coming out, by the way? It was supposed to come out this year, no? Did it get delayed again? Um, let's see. Last phase is tech, just so you know. Yep, I am aware of that. Uh, why not the Orb Changer, Super Saiyan Blue, Fizz Goku? We have so many options, right? Like, I could have brought a lot of people. It's just, I went with whoever, whatever I felt like. And I think this team's gonna be okay. Right? I don't think, I don't, I don't really expect to have any issues with, you know, Gohan and UI Goku and the Blue Fusions. I mean, in the Blue, Blue, Blue Fusions, can't even talk anymore, man, it's late. It's 3.30 a.m. Um, the Blue Fusions are actually going to be defensively the biggest liabilities but offensively they hit so hard that uh for the most part like i don't think many enemies are going to stay alive for long enough to really you know hurt us too bad uh well got demon demigra golden cooler and super saiyan 4 gohan not bad N not not bad uh, i know item ran this event with kamehameha sweet yo i didn't even change my items actually I mean, I guess it's not really going to be something I have to worry about. 
with this team. But yeah, I forgot that's only two item limit, so I probably should have brought like two healing items. And I think I have yeah, ghost. <laughs> I don't have any healing items. <laughs> I brought Ghost Usher and uh, Icarus, but it it, sh it should be fine. Keyword should should be fine. Uh, just pull back to back Vegito and Toa in my first multi, bro. You won. You won this banner. You won this banner. Two Vegitos and Toa in the first multi. You got the two main prizes and a dupe for a Vegito, which I didn't even get in 600 stones. Congrats, man. Congrats. Uh, new event is too easy. Well, I mean, it's not a bad thing, right? Because, like, a lot of newer players, you know, you want them to be able to beat these events and get the stones. Because, like, I know that feeling of, like, starting a new game and not being able to beat, you know, an event that comes out and, you know, missing out on a bunch of rewards right a bunch of stones and currency and all that stuff so i'm actually kind of glad that they kept it you know manageable for the average player um, that being said though it is also nice to have a challenge and so far it does not seem like this event provides that uh good night i got a win silver ice congrats man happy for you happy for everybody that got uh lucky congratulations if you guys got vegeto or multiple vegetos or whatever, you know, whatever units that you got. Hopefully it's ones that you liked. And um, like I said, I do think that this banner is great value um, because of the guaranteed feature in SSR, because all heroes units, so no matter what SSR you pull, at the very least, it's gonna be a collab unit. And uh, I would say 90, or at least like 80% of the units are very strong. And some of the newer units are absolutely top tier TURs in the game. Right, like in the top 10, top 20, at least the top 20 easily. Um, so yeah, I think it's worth it. I think it's worth it. No item with last, last resort, no problem. Well, yeah, when you use one of the most OP categories in the game, just like right now, right, we're using Kamehameha, like it would be actually kind of embarrassing if you think about it, if you didn't know item it. <laughs> 800 stones, seven Brolies, no Vegito. Oh. Bastion. Seven Brolies, zero Vegitos. Look, I, I've I've been there, man. I, I've been there, trust me. I know how that feels. But I'm just sorry you had to go through that too. Ah, oh, that's uh that's a rough time. Gave me one of them Brolies. I got two Brolies. I got two Brolies, so I'm happy about that. Um but I, I would have preferred more. Vegitos. Like, I would have given away all of my dupes for Toa and Broly and Gohan for just one extra copy of Vegito. Honestly, like, I would have given away two, two Toas, an extra Broly, an extra whatever, like, all the other stuff, all the other dupes I pulled, just for one more. One more Vegito. But it doesn't, it doesn't work like that. You know, the game will just give you, Arn Jesus will give you what it wants to give you. And I should be thankful that I got all the new units. Like, that's all I can really ask for at this point. Uh, AKA VAQS with a $2 dono. Rainbow, Toa, and Vegito only $13.50. Not too bad. Not too bad. Uh, let's heal meet with the 540. Sorry, 550. Uh, is that Euro? I think that's Euro, right? Euro donation, 500 stones, 3 SSJ4 Vegitos, 1 Super Saiyan 4 Broly, and 1 Super Saiyan 4 Bardock. That's awesome. The fact that you got three Vegitos, that's that's the main thing. That's the big win right there. Iron Jesus is a cruel mistress. They, it, it, it can be pretty cruel sometimes. It can be pretty cruel sometimes. Yeah, so we are blasting blasting through this event. Uh, should I pop my active skill? Or should I save it? Um, We'll save it. We'll save it. I don't think there's any rush to use it. And we still got quite a few stages, right? There's only the third stage I believe so I'll use it in probably like the last stage or the last the second last stage uh niner stones two vegetos nine bro nine brolies what is up with everybody pulling all the brolies man three toas four bardocks one gohan one deborah two black mass saiyan and three dark mass king that's not bad that's not bad child man needs an awakening I agree I, I agree with that posh um child man the, the greatest TUR in the game, right? I mean, now that he has a 170% leader, easily, easily the best TUR in the game. 
Um, he needs an awakening to be to be you know even more OP, obviously, because he doesn't he doesn't need it per se, but he deserves it because it's child man. Uh, I'm scared to summon Brady. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Just do it. All right, just pull out that band aid. Just uh, you know that video with uh, Shia LaBeouf like in front of a a green screen, the just do it thing. Just just go watch that video and then summon. Uh, two rainbow to every featured 650 stones. No Vegito. Ooh. So is that a win or is that an L? Because obviously Vegito is the main prize. But you did get a ton of featured units. So how, how do you feel about that right now? How do you feel about that right now? A Brammer with the $2 dodo. Four Vegitos, no Broly or Toa. Five hundred stones. That's a win. You basically almost rainbowed Vegito in 500 stones. Like what else could you ask for? I wanted Toa, not Vegito. Uh, so did you get Vegito instead of Toa? Is that what happened? Look, like, don't complain about getting Vegito, man. Don't, don't complain about getting Vegito. He's, he's one of the top, like, I, I don't actually know where he ranks because I gotta, like, test him out a little bit, but he's gotta be, like, in the top 10, right, of best TURs in the game. I heard some people say he's, like, numbered like top three or something like that i don't know about that okay I, I do need to test him out a little bit like on paper he looks amazing but i mean compared to like super saiyan 4 gogeta he's not as good as super saiyan 4 gogeta um you know golden frieza all that stuff but he, he's, he's up there he's up there uh vegeto sucks okay you know what that sounds like the guy that just said vegeto sucks that sounds like somebody that got shafted on the banner i'm sorry to, i'm sorry to hear that <laughs> but you cannot make a case for Super Saiyan 4 Vegito sucking. Okay, I, I can I can hear you know people saying, oh maybe he's like being hyped up too much or something like that, which I don't think is the case. But you can't say he sucks. Like there's there's nothing about him that sucks. Um, are you winning? I, I think we are. I, I think we are winning. Um, I'm not really paying too much attention, I'll be honest, because it's been kind of a cakewalk so far. Um, maybe the later stages will get my attention, but so far, there's really been no reason to pay too much attention. Because as you can see, we are uh, crushing it. We're, we're destroying this event right now. And Vegito might actually like solo this by himself. Oh, there's a super. Let's see how much this does. Whoa. Okay, okay, that got my attention. This, the, that, that, that just got my attention. All right, all right. 200k on, but oh my god, how did I miss two of them? Okay, uh, we go, we are, we are going to have to, um, yeah, make sure that doesn't happen again. Because I was not expecting to take that much damage. Yo, be careful on the stage, man. What's his name again? Is the but 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 Janks? No, not but Janks, but but Jax or something like that. These names are weird. I don't remember what they're called. Yeah, this this dude hits really hard. This 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 guy hits really hard. Go Hanks? Is it Go Hanks? But Jax? I don't really know. Um, Borikua Beast Gaming with the ten dollar dono. I did one K stones. Rainbow Dark Master Saiyan Broly. A oh, Dark Mass Saiyan, Broly, Gohan, Tempura, Fizz, Demigra, and Super Mira. Only got two Bardax, one Vegeta, and Toa. I'm still happy though. You should be happy, dude. Man, that's that's a lot of rainbows in 1k stones. Congrats, man. Um, I just found Toa's animation in cooler than Vegito's. In what way? Like, 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 explain to me cooler than Vegito's. It is different than Vegito's in a very specific way. That's for sure. That's for sure. Um, okay, so I am going to leave Gohan. I, I don't want to break up the Super Saiyan, the, the, the blue fusions, but I'm actually kind of worried about defense now. Right, so. Yeah, we're going to break them up. We're going to put Gohan there. And uh, after he supers, he should be around 200,000 defense, so um, we should be okay there. But yeah, that last super got my attention, man. I was like disrespecting the crap out of this event before, and then I saw 200k, and I was like, okay, it's getting a little bit serious. Oh, got the additional. Okay, so he should be well over 200k now. Um, <laughs> titties. Yes, yes, that is the main difference between Vegito and and uh, 
you know, Toa. 93k, I can live with that. I can live with that. Uh, Tiger, it is easy, don't worry. Hey, look, it's not that hard, but I still took a lot of damage from a super attack. So I think it's still necessary to exercise a little bit of caution. Bro, I got Broly, Toa, Super Mirror, and Gohan one multi. Damn. Um, how do you rank the new units best to worst? Okay, so I would probably go... I would probably go Vegito number one. Uh, Toa number two, because I do have a soft spot for, uh, for support units. And not only is she a all type support, she's also like amazing for extreme, right? And um, number three, I would probably go Broly. I would probably go Broly number three to Bura number four. Although those could be interchangeable. I have to think about that a little bit more. And then probably Gohan and then Bardock. Uh, but mainly because Bardock and um, Bardock and Gohan don't have awakenings yet, right? So once they get awakenings, they could easily be, I don't know, number one and number two, right? So we'll have to see about that. But in the meantime, yeah, uh, they're all really good. Like if I, I, I don't, I don't really need to rank them. Just get, just you know, any one you get is good. But um, I think that would probably be my ranking. Because, you know, you guys are forcing me to do one. Uh, ooh, so, I want to keep the Vegitos together, but at the same time, that super attack kind of worries me. I mean, actually, no, it should be, it should be fine. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, just, we'll just go with this. And Vegito is tanky enough to actually take a super, right? We have 161,000 defense. And we, we'll probably actually just kill him. I, like I'm, de I'm debating all this stuff right now, and I just realized he's pretty low on HP. So, with a couple counters and a super, yeah, he's dead. He's dead. Never mind. <laughs> it's not even a concern. Uh, by the way, the crossover is the very first category, so don't search. Um, don't search. It is first. Got it. Good tip right there. Good tip. He's the f it's the first category um, in the list, right? Um, I don't have a Jito, but I got five Gohans, three Deboras, Mana Med. Look, I know it seems bad right now. Is Supreme Kai of Time the last, uh, the last one? Is, is she the final boss? Oh my God, so many attacks. Uh, I mean, defensively we should be okay. I'm not gonna use an item, nah. Nah, we can't use an item, that's, that'd be sad. Okay, so we have, we have 261,000 defense. I think that's more than enough, right? To, to tank a super if she if she supers us. Yeah, yeah that there's 11, there's 60, 69, nice. Nice. Um, Gohan knows what's up, man. Gohan knows what's up. All right, so we got the super. So now we should have like 300k or so. And yeah, we're good, we're good. I was a little bit worried. I was, I was a little bit worried but we didn't need to be. I really like the wizardry that we can't seem from most other DB characters. I really like the wizardry. What, what does that mean? <laughs> I'm confused, I'm confused. Uh, I am running through event to collect for one more multi. Yes, yeah, so we get 25 stones, I think, for this event. So if you guys need a few more stones for you know another summon, then just do this one. Should, it shouldn't take you too long. Like, we, we're, we've been going for about 20 minutes, but the only reason it took 20 minutes is because I've been talking to you guys the entire time. If I was paying attention the whole time, then uh, it wouldn't have taken that long, obviously. Okay, we're gonna pop the active skill here. If this active skill doesn't kill her, then we can put him back into the first slot, and he can get up to, like, four super attacks if we get a uh, additional from the hidden potential system. But I think this is gonna end it, actually. Like, this very unlike- Oh! Okay, so she survived. Um, all right, that's fine. What we'll is ended uh, ended with uh, a Vegito super then? Yo, watch watch her super me for like six hundred thousand damage. Never mind, <laughs> we're good. <laughs> we're good. I actually forgot that we had the high chance to dodge too after we attack in the third slot. So that's gonna do it.
that's gonna do it um events i would say overall it's kind of mid all right not not super easy i definitely want to say it's super easy not very hard either though just kind of kind of mid kind of mid and of course i'm i'm looking at this from the perspective of like a newer player or not a newer player just like an average dokkan player like not a whale or anything like that I, th I, th I think it's mid okay so all the missions are done that's gonna be 25 stones plus the one for clearing the missions or clearing the event so you actually get 26 stones in total and oh yo we have exactly five 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 stones is that a sign is that is that a, is that a good luck omen does that mean we're gonna get a vegeto if we summon right now <laughs> no i can't <laughs> yo we just spent like 700 stones man i don't know I, d I don't know i think you think too much you're probably right you're probably right i i do think i think too much i do i do think i think too much um but i i, I like these things actually kind of get to me man i'm not like usually superstitious but these numbers in a row like that that sometimes i'm like hey it could mean something it could it could be a sign guys if i would do one we'll do one more multi we we'll do one more multi. We got, we got fives in a row. Okay, it can't be a coincidence. <laughs> this is the addiction talking right now. Can't be a coincidence. Okay, it, it, it must be a sign that we're gonna pull some fire right now. So, here we go. Last one, last one of the stream. Uh, first one of the video, if you guys are watching this, of course, as a solo video later on. I'm gonna pull down. No animation, doesn't really matter though, because we know we're getting that featured unit regardless. And uh, let's go together in three, two, one, let it rip. All right, all right. Yo, to reward ourselves for a very good run, a very solid clear. Yo, actually my first Super Saiyan God animation on this banner. That was actually my first Super Saiyan God animation. On this banner three heroes units incoming three heroes units incoming right now all right what's it gonna be three vegetos let's get three vegetos come on no you know you want ah it's the Bora. all right i'll take it i'll take it he's good just uh not what we're looking for right now it was a sign <laughs> It was a sign. It was a sign. What did I say? Numbers in a row. You got to summon. Okay. If you have repeating numbers, if you have repeating numbers. It, it means that you're about to pull fire. So you have to summon. <laughs> That's awesome, man. That's freaking awesome. All right. All right. We still got one more too. It's not over. It's not over. We still got at least one more. Come on, Vegito dupe number two, right here, right now. Nope, next one, next one, right now. Ah, it's Dark Masking, I'll take it, I'll take it. He's 79% now, I believe. Yeah, okay, well, there you have it. <laughs> there you have it, it was a sign. Three featured, yeah, three featured units in that multi right there. Um, no more summons though. No more summons. Five oh five means nothing. Okay, that's not repeating. Okay, we're not. We're not gonna. We're not gonna use that as a sign. But uh, yeah, it worked out, guys. It worked out. So that is our time patrol event run. Like I said, man, not too hard, not too difficult, or not too easy. Just uh, kind of in the middle. Um, if you have a really good team, if you have like a OP team like the one we just ran, or you know, a good. Uh, find a trump card team or something like that it shouldn't be an issue at all it should be able to no item it um if you have a not as good team but a couple stackers it should still be fine just pay attention to the supers in the later stages because they do hit pretty hard as you saw my vegeto at 79 percent with max links got hit for 200k right so uh be careful about that but overall not too bad so uh for anybody watching this as a video thank you so much for watching like the damn stream or like the damn video sub to the channel Hit that notification bell, and we are out of here. All right.